Hello, and welcome back to Making the Cut. Today, we're going to talk about veal. Veal is a young cattle which is milk fed, and the best cuts of veal come from the leg. Okay? This, this is the leg. This is the top round, which is one of my favorite parts. But I'm going to show you my most, and what I enjoy the most, is called cutlets from the veal hip. Guys, when you go to your butcher and you may ask for this particular cut of veal, the veal hip, remember that name. He's going to hate you for it because there's only one piece in every leg and it only weighs about two, two and a half to three pounds the most. But again, it's the best piece of veal you ever had. I'm going to show you how we go about, there's, there's a, a piece of nerve in here, grizzle as you might call it, which I'm going to remove now. Of course, you try to leave as much meat on the cutlet side, not on the grizzle side. You're just getting that tendon out of there. Exactly. And this is one side, and this is the other. This one over here also has a little grizzle, but I'm not gonna bother removing it because I'm gonna take a couple of slices just to show you what it looks like. Here we go. Now the trick to slicing veal cutlets is you wanna make sure that you're cutting it across the grain. That way, when you cut it, I'll, I'll, I'll demonstrate. When you cut it, you have a, a very short grain in there and that makes it much more tender than if you will have a stringy long piece. I'm gonna show you the other piece. There's a different way of cutting it because it's not as wide, it's skinnier and longer. I'm gonna show you the different technique of cutting that. The first slice, we slice it a little thicker than we normally would and then we butterfly it. But that's only the first slice. Okay, then after that, they're actually big enough to slice. See? We give it a little bit of an angle, that way it makes the cutlet a little bit bigger. If you cut it too straight, you're gonna get smaller slices. And Well, for, for, yeah, hot and fast, exactly. That, you, you know, for those that are watching your weights, your diets, and they can't eat certain things, um, you know, you can grill it. But again, it's gotta be done quickly. If you want, you can marinate it in a little balsamic vinegar, oregano, uh, uh, and some other things, even lemon, you know, uh, if you wanna keep it a little more plain, just a little lemon and olive oil. Uh, and that's about it, really. And remember, Drive your butcher crazy. Ask for this cut of veal. You'll know if he uses good veal if he has this veal.